parents, uh, make sure you drive your children towards God. Chase them towards God so that you won't be chasing them in life, going around for all of them, you know, when they have gotten into trouble. Don't wait till challenge starts. If a child is planted in God, that child has an encounter with God, you have secured the destiny of that child. Many parents, is still later after the child has gone to do and manifest practically in the wrong direction, then they start running around to try and join the child to God. It's not then. Start now. Are you listening to me? I've said many times, the greatest treasure I believe that my parents gave me is God. That's the best thing. I left home very early. I was not yet, I, I, I just turned 16 when I left home. I've not been back since. <laughs> Are you hearing me? I, I came across too many things to scatter me. Too many things to scatter me. From the first year I left, the opportunities for disaster presented themselves. But thank God I knew God. You won't know me today. Are you getting what I'm saying? So push them towards God and make sure they have practical, tangible encounters that are practicable. The one they can handle. Are you listening to me? Uh -huh. that's, how to, that's how to move them up in God. No, we run around for many other things. A parent who will not bring a child to a meeting like that still is the one that will take the child to horse riding, take the child to uh, swimming, take the child to every other thing except the thing that matters to God. Are you get what I'm saying? Nothing wrong with swimming, nothing wrong with riding. I like horses, nothing wrong with riding horses. But the issue is push a child to God first. That's where security lies. Are you hearing what I'm saying? Push a child to God, that is where security lies. Myself and my wife, we had a very funny encounter. My daughter went to a school to go and try, you know, I don't know what they, they, uh, what do they call it? Starter class. Tester class, thank you. Tester class. She went for tester class in one school like that. I, I've already said she's not going to that school. You know, but just tester class for the sake of testing. So she went to... <laughs> She went to the class, and as soon as she came out, she was having a conversation with her mom. And she said, Mommy, why can't, why can't you find me a Christian big school? I said, uh, she said, why? He said, because they, 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 were, they, were, they had witches in the class, you know. <laughs> Images of witches, toys for the children to play with. They had, he said they had witches in the class images of witches and toys and all of that and I refused to play with it if you don't push your child you say child is too young to know you know children of nowadays you will have nowadays challenge <laughs> are you hearing what I'm saying let's wake up to reality my children are in service usually they go to their children's church when there is no children, they come into the presence of God is addictive, sir. They enter into church, not just uh, standing. No, it's not just being present. They must encounter God by force and by fire, because that is the only thing that will preserve them. Are you getting what I'm saying? Let us wake up. Let's wake up. Let's wake up. The spirit of the world is killing many in our generation. Don't be caught in the trap. God will help our understanding. I think that's almost a message and a teaching on the song. If you hear, say I hear. I love you if not, I won't tell you that, but it's the truth. Amen? It's the truth. Are you getting what I'm saying? Uh -huh. You will have children that will give you rest. You will enjoy your old age in the name of Jesus Christ. No child will be taking you to police station to bail them out in the name of Jesus Christ. Somebody believe it, shout aloud, amen. So, parental responsibility is important. To ensure that these children are pushed into God. God will help understand it.